Hello friends, I welcome all of you into this course and I'm going to start this course with the most popular question and the question is what is cloud computing? Uh, everyone knows that it's very popular. Many people get asked in interviews and uh, and you must know that there is a lot of media hype right now in the world about cloud computing. So let me doubt, uh, write it here, <laughs> cloud computing. So, okay. Like I told you, there's a lot of media hype. Everyone thinks that it's a, it's a kind of, you know, miraculous product solution or a technology that is, com that is going to completely change the world of IT. And uh, many are in misconception about it. And let me tell you the real answer for it. Okay, if someone asks you about it, simply say that it's basically a model, model for IT. Okay. So what this model does, it will basically make you enable to use or consume the resources which are shared at far location or we call it cloud. Okay. And you can use it as per your need. So I'll give you one very fine example. First of all, you need to know what are the uh, few companies, top companies which are into this cloud based solution. First is uh, AWS. Let me change the color for it. Okay. One company which is uh, very popular right now and it is on top of it. It's AWS which means Amazon Web Services. Second one is Microsoft which has a solution named Azure. Okay. So this is uh, top two companies and probably you'll find many more like HP also has similar kind of cloud-based solution so why do we need cloud uh, I'll give you one example let's say that you've decided to open a website okay you want to make it very popular like facebook.com and you've named it as a uh, network chap.com okay so in case you have to manage this site at your own office or by yourself what you will do first thing is that you need to buy office space okay office space you need to have power connections you need to have seating arrangement I'm, I'm just talking about the basic things okay then there will be four thing technical things okay we'll talk about technical IT router switches router for van switches for LAN, firewall for security and like I told you you need to have power backup as well like UPS okay and there should not be any power disruption else your site will go down you need to uh, maintain security endpoint security by installing antivirus on, on that particular server where you will host it you need to have a lot of RAM because your user, user base will increase, you need to have RAM, you need to have operating system, uh, hard disk, then Linux, Unix, many more things. So if you will buy all these things, you will end up spending a lot of money. And I'm sure you wouldn't like to do it, okay, unless you get some popularity or you have enough uh, output of the site. So what is the best solution? Best solution is that you speak to one of these two companies or any popular cloud-based solution which offers you, uh, you know, good facility. So what will happen in cloud? In cloud, let me delete it first. In uh, cloud will have its own infrastructure and those things will not be visible to you and they will not share what they have internally. So it will be like this thing, you know simple like a uh, cloud you just need to log in into the portal you will map this site to their web hosting as per the plan that you chose then you can decide how much ram you want to use okay how much uh, space or hard disk you want to have you don't have to worry about the power backup or disaster recovery okay these things are being managed by them and they offer you 99.99% of uptime, okay? You don't need to worry about the data backup. Obviously, you have to pay for it. 
then you can pick what kind of antivirus you want do you want to manage application yourself or you want them to manage it you will pick operating system and uh, other applications like business applications if you want to host your site on the wordpress i'm just giving you one example it can be any server as well it can be any debit card credit card server that you want to host on the internet or cloud i mean so ultimately you will be able to manage all these things with just a login you just have to login into the portal and click submit these things will be set up for you you will be paying only for the services which you are using that's the best thing about this cloud computing model okay so means everything will be given to you you just need to select as per your own need and it will be all up so that's kind of you know platform or you can say infrastructure they have provided to you you don't have to maintain multiple internet connection like sometime internet goes down you don't have to speak to anyone so i have i've given you this example from the perspective of uh, networks or setting up a small business so i will also talk about the other definitions of uh, cloud computing so the other uh, definition is that no matter which provider you choose you'll almost find everything in every cloud solution okay so whether you go to aws microsoft azure they will have some some things as common you know first thing will be like the environment will be virtual it is one of the common characteristics among all of the cloud computing providers that uh, this uh, cloud solution is flexible second is it is virtual and it is scalable these are the common things which every cloud provider will provide you and obviously its price will be very cheap comparatively setting your own business and you don't need to worry about the secure security they will have everything for you and of course it will be within your reach that is affordable so these are the things that you will uh, get in this cloud computing so as we go on with other chapters you will have more clarity about it and friends it's very interesting and it's a future you must know it so i hope that it's been informative to you and i would like to thank you for viewing have a nice day